Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum everyone. In this video tutorial, we are going to learn a new instruction XOR for 8086 microprocessor in assembly language. And the instruction format is quite simple XOR D, S. XOR is the logical word or the keyword, and uh, the D is destination operand, and S is source operand. And what is going to happen? It is also part of logical instructions as we have discussed and an OR instruction before. So uh, what will be the operation performed? The D and the S will be used as operands and there will be XOR operation and the result will be stored in the destination operand. XOR is important or exclusive or is important logical operation and this will be performed during the execution of this instruction, right? Let's test this instruction in, some, in EMU8086 environment we, as we have tested for N and OR instructions. So this is the emulator environment and we have we are using almost similar program we, which we have used in OR and, and, and gates. Uh, so we are using the same program for exclusive OR so that uh, user can easily understand this tutorial as well, right? So let's emulate this code. So first line to be executed, it says 458 should be moved in AX. Let's execute this line. So 458 is moved. The next line is move CX comma zero E eight seven. So zero E eight seven will be moved in CX. We can see that. And the next line is performing XOR operation between CX and AX, right? So exclusive OR operation, it says whenever we have two different inputs, we should be high. So first we will check these uh, 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 numbers, uh, exclusive OR result in manually, and then we will test it in uh, emulator results, right? So 458 is converted into binary and 0E87 is converted into binary because you want to test uh, exclusive OR operation. So 00, zero result are same, uh, inputs are same, result would be 001, zero, zero, inputs are different, so result would be 1, 00, zero, 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 okay, 01, zero, 1, 1, 1, one is uh, in 1, sorry, 0, zero 01, 1, 1, zero, one 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 zero 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 one zero one zero 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 one zero one 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 okay i i hope you remember the basic principle whenever inputs are same then result would be zero and in, if inputs are different then result would be high so this is the principle i have used to perform the logical exclusive or operation so now i will be converting it to result will be converting into what uh, hexadecimal so zero one double zero it's four one zero one one it is basically eleven and that is b uh, double zero one zero that means two four times one that means f so four b two f should be the exclusive or result and it should be coming in destination operand which is cx so if we apply if we execute this instruction move cx comma ax as it is indicated here it is yellow instruction so if I'm going to press single step, so this instruction will be executed and CX will have this result, 4B2F. So let's execute. 4B2F is now stored in CX register, which means this exclusive OR operation is verified in EMU8086 environment. I hope you have understood this instruction. It's quite easy. Uh, one of the very, very most important uh, logical instruction which is used to compare the two numbers if they are same they will provide zero if they are different they will provide one right uh, so uh, still if you have any confusion in this instruction you can post your queries and uh, confusions in comment section thank you so much for listening